guys, we are in our new house and this is the first set of pots I have placed so far. This is our back entryway, kind of where we park our cars and it gets a lot of sun during the day. So I thought you might like to see what I'm gonna be planting up. This container already has a spruce lollipop. I love this plant. I love the formality it brings and then you can really see the stuff that you plant below it. Um, and these have survived. This is its third season in this pot, so. So the thing about having evergreens in containers that it, it makes it kind of hard to switch out. You can't really put fresh soil in every single year. So what I do is I scrape out the top few inches of soil and put fresh stuff in, which I've already done. Um, put my soil, soil right back here. Uh, and then I like to add in a slow release fertilizer to add some nutrients back to the soil. I'll do that. And I'll just use my hands to work that in. So let me show you the plants I'm gonna be using. For pots this size that have a centerpiece, I like to use six plants. I'll use three of the same thing. I just split it into thirds. And for that, I'm gonna be using the Supertunia Bordeaux, which is one of my favorites. I love the color. And then for the other three plants, I go in between those Supertunias with something different. All three of them are different. So I like to do a foliage trailer, which this one is an Illusion Midnight Lace Potato Vine, which I think brings out the center of this Bordeaux Petunia. And then I'm gonna use a Super Bell's Coral Berry Punch for a punchy color and yellow chiffon super bells. Really soft and pretty. So, now a plant. The next one is just right over here. Dexter, you, <laughs> you cannot be in here right now. They are all done and I think they turned out so pretty. I love all the color. Um, like I said, these are in full sun. Uh, but all of these plants thrive in that kind of condition and I will be watering these probably every day throughout the heat of the summer. And even though I put in some slow release fertilizer, I will still go in with regular fertilizer every once in a while just to give them a quick shot and keep them healthy and full of color and bloom. And you guys, I have a ton more containers to plant, so prepare yourselves. Uh, you'll probably be seeing lots of container videos coming up pretty shortly. Thank you guys so much for watching and we will see you in the next video. Bye.